All right, we got a big day today. Class is in session. We got a VOD review for Team Liquid. We got a whiteboard for hella f***ing official. We got we're in Team Liquid VOD review for Sweden. Oh, Cam is flipped. Oh, let me change that. Good call, baby. Good f***ing call. Oh, f Wait. Oh, f We went it. Bam. There we go. So before we start writing some things down, let's go over a little bit. Now, the reason we're reviewing, we're re reviewing Sweden land. Team Liquid plays very well. They play second place with 69 points. Sex. Now, we're going to go and vocally say our main concern, my main concerns for Liquid. Things Liquid. Am I mirrored right now? Oh, f***. Nice. Things Liquid needs to change. Okay, number one. Number one. It's flipped again. Number one, get rid of Nocturnal. Nocturnal, dog shit. Two, Sykes not ego chowling everything. Sykes has a severe ego problem. He has a controller just like me, but in his hands, bro, he thinks he has the infinity stones. If they put Sykes on a leash like those kids at Walmart, then I think they're going to be in a better position. Work on cloning two more fun FPSs. Fun equals great. Rest of team equals shit. Four, break Hodsick out of nursing home. Should be the last one. Those are the four things. One, get rid of Nocturnal. Two, make Sykes not ego chow. But throughout this time, you're not going to see Sykes because Sykes is ass and he's not on the team yet. So he's dog. Three, clone two more fun FPSs. Four, get Hodsick out of the nursing home. Simple as that. These are the main points we're going to go through. Now, also, let's discuss drop spots. Liquid, they land trials. Gold armor. Okay, gold armor all the time. Storm point, cascades. Why? Why are they landing cascades? I have no idea why. I think that Liquid is so good at teamfight off spawn. I think they could get a more lucrative POI than cascades. Okay? I don't need this anymore. So there we go. That's the breakdown right there for Liquid. We got the Stockholm Finals. This is the winner's <laughs> bracket real quick. So gonna be, like we said, we land, they land over in Trials. All right, Trials is done. So the play is to send one over, here, do so. Trials. Now okay. Trials loot, bro, you get a f ton of loot, Chad. You guys gotta realize that, man. You get so much loot. Guaranteed gold armor pretty much almost every time. Gold bag, helmet, etc. I think they're, they're on the southeast side, okay? You guys on me? Well, I like this. So they're gonna oh, yeah, keep yeah, on yeah. our team here. Hopefully. That should be really nice. So they make the rotate over from Trials to I'll say pretty fast, bro. Round two closing. They get a trials loot. They get they crafted a little bit too over in Lava Visher. They the balloons. This shit pretty fast, low key overall. It's pretty good rotate. So like one thing with launch site, bro, when it goes to like dome endings, getting across this open gap from where they are at launch site to dome is like super, super difficult. I'm Unless they use Valkulti. So Valkulti is pretty much, pretty much almost a guarantee when it comes down to it. Brandon, on, on, on us, on us, on us. Yeah, I know. I'm just okay. Landed, 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 landed. On me, on me. On Holy shit, he got a fucking land on. They bubbled also, just stabilize, stabilize, stabilize. I ult in the front of our bubble. Yep. Nice, I'm really good ult right there by guild. Safe on me, safe on me right now, safe on me, safe on me, safe on me. Run across, I'm run across, them. run across, run across. Good. See how he's fucking telling his team what to do, bro? Yeah, it's actually so good. See, but you see, like, chat, that's like one thing I think you guys have to realize. It sets IGLs apart right now. What Nocturnal is doing, it's like commanding his team, confidence, telling him where to go, follow me, do this. Like, things like that right now, I think when you're speaking with such confidence and such clarity, it's so important, bro. We're safe. I'm yelling. Go to the left. Go to the left. Right, 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 right. Careful, knock, careful, knock. I just knock. Knock. Look at the calm, right. calm by knock, bro. Not even a fucking I'm second guess on Gibson, bro. Dude, that's I'm why Gilbert is such a phenomenal teammate, bro. Gonna, Having a super hyper confident control player like that, bro, is actually so fucking good. Good shit, boys. We're stabilizing. Yes, Pass me that old cell. I can get my old. Comms are okay, so okay. fucking gorgeous, man. Verhulst goes down. Full oh, white. Give me low. Give me low. Crack behind the shield. So they play this perfect. They're pretty much just holding the right side. The eggshell is giving them complete cover from the right. They're all hard focusing left. All teams from the house and dome need to rotate out. They fucking stick to the wall. They have gas traps down. Gilderson's playing a little bit of an off angle just in case they get wide sweep from the right. Like this is like actually such picture perfect like fucking gameplay for the circle, bro. Dead. And they get all the KP. They're literally just confirming all their KP on the side. We're the only team on this side. Yes. Just play safe. Play safe, boys. We get top two right here. And that's a really, really good I'm comm too. Don't get too aggressive. Knock, 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 knock. Get nice. that ball, get I'm that batting, ball. I'm batting. I'm moving up. So now them having this whole fucking side to themselves, you can see how aggressive they can get on the eggshell area and start to pressure these teams that are inside of the RV on the other side of eggshell. Now they can start making aggressive plays right here to start weeding these teams out, making them use heals, making them go down, maybe just take damage in general, you. anything like that. Okay. Look at the left, look at the yeah, left, yeah, look yeah. at the left. Look at these fucking shots, bro. Just literally free kills. Get that ball, get that ball. 
There we go. Three more fucking kills right there for fucking Team Liquid, dude. They're literally just rocking on the kills right now because no one's on their backs up. Feel free to cost your intro as the trailer. I got another ulti, another ulti, another ulti, another ulti. Right here, I'm big, I'm big, I'm big. Good ulti right there. It's gonna pressure them to play one side to really, really get off by Gilderson, man. That's gonna isolate that team so hard. Just play as quiet as you can. Play as quiet as you can. Hey, listen. That's a fucking calm. I need y'all to fucking listen to in all ranks, bro. So many of y'all, bro, will just fucking be in like a top three scenario. And if you just let the other teams fight, you're good. They don't want to get hard focus because if you're the first team to get hard focus here, you're going to die. You want to be the team that's helping another team kill a team for a fucking top two. So you have just a 3v3. You don't always just have to kill fucking everybody. And could Liquid just hop in right now, bro? And shoot? Yeah, for sure. Now, bubbling out backwards. Come to Why me, the fuck would they do that? They're stalling these fights out as long as possible. Because if you're the first two teams to fight here, bro, you're guaranteed not to win, most likely. Arc Watch the arc. Watch the arc. I'm pretty much just dead here, I think. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Play on me. Play on me. Play on me. Bump and fire. Bump and fire. This is so rough. There's really nothing you can do in this situation, though. I'm just dead. I can't see anything. And then it's dead. Good fucking game, boys. Good shit. This was a really fucking good game, man. That was going to be C9 winning this out, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. The other Crazy. Just... What you just fucking saw is the main reason people don't like Gibraltar or Caustic at all. The screen, the visual card is just crazy. Like, that's I'm just nuts, dude. So that was first game. Yeah, so Team Liquid in that first game had eight kills. Third place. It was a really good first game overall for Team Liquid. All right, well, they're back on the fucking trials, loot. We're gonna have a gold fucking purple purple, bro. Gold helmet. It's fucking insane. So. Revalco feed phase comes know, out. I'm, I'm they're gonna rotate in this. from the fragment side. It's probably Empire. You want me to go or... in and barrel it? Or just the Emperor. The... That was, that was, the that was the exit, 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 exit. So they're gonna barrel their back. That's actually really smart, too. You guys need to do this with costing more often. You need to kind of like lay trails of costing barrels so you know where teams are rotating, right? They're putting barrels over in the tunnel side. So now when they rotate into Harvester, they know what team's going to be coming in from this front side near Fragment. So they're getting shot from the right, but then Gilderson gets a tick on his barrel on the left. They know that a team is coming from the left and their right. It's really, really good information. I definitely think that's something y'all need to fucking see and, and understand too as a costing mate. So now they have to actually push forward. Just heal, just heal, just heal. Look, barrel right, right, creep. Right, right, right. Do you back. see this, bro? It's the creeper on this team. Barrel creep. Barrel creeping is like taking positions with your barrels. You throw a barrel, shoot your barrel, move up to that position. You creep further and further into a spot you want, pushing the other team back while moving forward. Maybe we just slam the low ground. Huh. Yeah, I'm down. Okay, so they want to slam the low they're, ground here, which is 100% the right call. They want to take that low ground spot. So the low ground spot on Harvester isn't bad, but it's not like good. We're slamming low ground. Right here. Right get here. inside, get inside, get inside, yep. Get ready to fight, get ready a to fight. very interesting Just stay against the door, do not move. Yep. Or, I'm come outside, come outside, come outside. Yep, got it. We're good. Good call by Fun to come outside and not play the inside. The inside is deceivingly more dangerous. It doesn't look like it's going to be, but it is. Listen for climbs. Yeah, I'm, I'm trapping everything, bro. Nice. This is such a good fucking play style for them, bro. 160 I, in the middle. Okay, looking, looking. Look. I know energy is really good right now, bro. But <laughs> oh, my God. The Kraber shot from yeah, Knock. So right now, this is like a perfect really spot for Liquid, dude. They have all the traps set up. The zone's ending a little bit underneath them on the right side. I also want to say this really fast. Liquid got second place without winning one game the whole tournament. It's consistency, bro. And it's consistency from Nox IGLing. It's consistency from Fun's co-IGLing and Gilderson's fragging. For you as players chat, you need to find your role in a lot of these different situations, a lot of these different metas. And it's a really, really hard thing to do because sometimes you your ego gets in the way or your confidence gets in the way or whatever it may be, right? Because when you're trying to do too many things that you're not, it actually overall hurts your gameplay pretty badly. Careful, careful, careful. High ground. So there's, there's a hole in the high ground okay, as long you, as possible you. for the jump off, bro. This is I such a... Watch your eyes. Blah, 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 blah. I'm dropping right now. One second left. One second left. Ripping a bat. Nice. This is good barrel creeps. We swing left. We swing left on me. We just stand on the open. I all stand here. We stand here. We stand here. Front door. This is front such good door, fucking cons, bro. Right that ulti by fucking kill, bro. It's huge. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Wow, oh, good yeah, fucking cool. cod by Liquid right, here. Right, no bubble, no bubble, no bubble, no bubble. Okay, no bubble, no bubble. Hello, come to me, come to me. Okay. Shoot drone, shoot drone. Speaking I'm gonna right. bubble late, I'm bubbling. Bubbling yep, now, yep, bubbling yep, now. Yep, yep. Great fucking bubble by oh, Fun. We are, we are, last bubble. Yep. Above us, above us. Above He's one to the right, one to the right. How did they get fucking Pitch cover? Right. Play your life, play your life. Nice. Nice. Good Good fucking Let's job! Go. Great fucking bubble by knock. I mean by fun. Good fucking ulti by Gilderson on the right side. I think Gilderson put a perfect ultimate down so the right side team cannot fucking peek Gilderson when they swing far left. Come here, come here. Absolutely fucking gorgeous gameplay by, by, by fucking my team liquid here, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
Yep. Chat, in these situations, man, you want to be the last bubble up. More protection, everyone else shooting each other, everyone redirects focus. You want to be the last bubble up, big dogs. What a Why good job by Fun for the bubble. Are, and then Nocturnal did his job by going straight the fuck up in the air, big dog. Look at this. He fucking falls down from the heavens and he gets fucking second place, bro. Picture fucking perfect right there from Team Liquid. All right. Well, damn. Class is now over. The bell's going to be rung. VOD review is now finito. What a good fucking day, man. I love you guys, dude. Thank you guys for being great. Thanks for being here. Have a great rest of your fucking night. And how you darn. Bye. Love you guys.